This is an AI-generated image. And so is this video. Do you find this weirdly familiar? Is this perhaps something you've seen in your dreams? Weird faces, shapes shifting and all that? You might not be the only one. But why is this happening? And what does it have to do with the simulation theory? To understand this, we need to look at the history of AI and how it's evolved over the years. It's the 1950s and the term artificial intelligence is coined by John McCarthy, a computer scientist at Dartmouth College. The idea was to create a machine that could think and learn like a human. Ideas of artificial intelligence came when I un uh, attended a conference, uh, a symposium on cerebral mechanisms and behavior. Fast forward to 1997, and IBM's Deep Blue becomes the first computer to beat a world chess champion. It's a slow motion moment. Deep Blue has defeated world champion Gary Kasparov in an absolutely that was a major milestone for AI, as it showed that a machine could outperform a human in a complex task. In 2011, IBM's Watson wins Jeopardy, a popular quiz show, beating two of the show's greatest champions. Correct. This new achievement showed that a machine could understand and process natural language. In 2016, Google's AlphaGo beats a world champion in the game of Go, a game that's considered to be more complex than chess. I don't see anything. We can't find anything. <laughs> this was another major milestone for AI, as it showed that a machine could outperform a human in a game that's considered to be the most complex game ever created. In 2018, OpenAI's GPT-2, a language model, becomes capable of generating human-like text. Since its creation, AI has been used in a variety of ways, from creating music and playing games to writing poetry and automating tasks. But what about AI-generated images and videos? The first AI graphics were created in the 1960s, but it wasn't until the 2010s that AI-generated images and videos started to become more realistic. Early AI-generated images and videos looked weird, barely resembling real content, but the feature was promising, and over the years, AI-generated content has improved significantly. From Dale and Midjourney with their astonishing generated graphics to Sora, OpenAI's new text-to-video, AI-generated content has become more realistic and harder to distinguish from real content. And here's where it gets interesting. There's a parallel between AI-generated content and dreams no one has ever talked about. Our brains have immense computing power. But that power decreases when we are asleep to a point that it's more or less equivalent to the computing power of a nowadays neural network. What we see in our dreams is strikingly similar to what AI generates. Could this be a coincidence? Or is there a deeper connection between the two? Similar to a computer, the human brain processes information and generates content, such as dreams, based on that information. The more you know and the older you grow, the more complex and vivid your dreams become. Similarly, the more data AI has, the more realistic and complex its generated content becomes. But the striking similarity between AI-generated content and what we perceive as reality doesn't end here. Same as glitches in a computer program, real life has its own glitches, such as optical illusions, deja vus, and other unexplained phenomena. Many of these glitches can be explained by the simulation theory, which suggests that we're living in a computer simulation. 
Take the Mandela Effect, for example, where people remember events differently than they actually happened. I begin to notice these inconsistencies. Do you remember where this was taken? Yeah, it's Griffith Observatory. I swear, I remember taking this photograph, we, but we were in Seattle. This could be a glitch in the simulation, similar to a bug in a computer program. Or time travel, which is theoretically possible in a computer simulation, as the simulation could be paused, rewound, or fast-forwarded. There are many stories of people experiencing time travel, such as the Philadelphia Experiment and the Montauk Project. We might never know if these stories are true, but they do make you wonder and question reality. So what does all this mean? It means that we might be living in a computer simulation and that AI-generated content in dreams could be a window into that simulation. As these technologies continue to improve, we might be able to see more of what's behind the curtain and understand the true nature of our reality. One thing is for sure, we are about to unveil the biggest secret of our time. And this might change everything we know about our reality.